Siri, Zirel, can you hear me? I can. I must leave you now. We will meet beneath drowned dead rock. Can you remember? Mm -hmm. Repeat it. Drowned dead rock. You're awake, and I thought you'd... Where, where am I? And who are you? It's all right. You're on Hindersfjall, village of Lofoten. They call me Skjall. But how'd I... What? We fished you out of the sea. Me and that friend of yours. Help... Help me stand. I, I don't... I don't think you should... Less talk, more giving me a hand. Ah, that's me brother for you. Out of sight for a second, and he's already put his paws on a girl. Astrid, you're as dim as dishwater. You know perfectly well I'm helping her up. It's a shame, I know, but I've got to interrupt your courtship. Come, we're off to the sauna. Where? Why is your mouth agape like you're noodling for an eel? The sauna. Girl, you was blue as a whale when we brought you in here. Your blood needs thawing. I'm sorry, but I must get to Drowned Dead Rock as fast as possible. I shan't force you to stay, but the rock's a ways off and you can barely walk. You best take a horse. True. Skjall can prepare a horse for you. You'll have to wait a spell, but even so, you'll get there faster than on foot. Fine, that'll do. Thank you both very much. Pish posh, there's no need. Now come, we gotta sweat the sick out of you. Where are my clothes? I've taken them already. Come on. That man in the mask, he's from afar, isn't he? Oh yes, I'm very far away. Where exactly? Aren't you nosy? Surprised? Been sitting in this fish puddle my whole life. I'd love to travel like you. Like me? No, you wouldn't like that. Trust me. All right. In you go and get out of those rags. All of them? I should think so. It's a souvenir of someone special who's dead now. I picture it already. You were promised. <laughs> Close. Storms are coming. You've got to go to your mom. Tell her to take the wash towel. You keep practicing. Right. If your fingers tear, grip the string with. Oh, you're here. The horses are ready. As am I. Shall we ride? Listen, I. I hope. My sister. She didn't talk any nonsense to you, did she? 
No. Uh, except to mention that you fancy me. Wh what But I asked her... Besides, it's not... Of course, you are very... But... You know what? Let's ride. You're in a hurry and it'll be done. Not in that much of a hurry. <clears throat> Your first kiss, wasn't it? Of course it weren't. Uh, I... Me first. We don't have much time. But it's enough for you to learn a few things. Run for your lives! You stay here! I'll go and... I can look after myself. What was that? The Wild Hunt. Ragnarok? The world's end? No. Not yet. But I must go. They're here for me. Get on the horse. I'll show you the way to the rock. I don't know how to thank you. You can thank me once we get there safe. Let's ride. What became of that creature? Where is he? What? I saw him and stood on, but he sold him. To whom? No. No. 
be gone. It's uh, just to tell them. Let's get out of here. Now. You needn't ask me twice. The garden! Our garden! How could you? We helped! And you! Inconceivable! Now, now. Don't you dare try to calm me! We'd every right to be furious! Furious! And you! You will pay for this! We had no choice. We'd never have learned what happened to her. Do you really think you're justified? That your hunt for a foreign woman gives you the right to destroy our garden? I'm sure it doesn't in your eyes. I shall make sure all Skellige hears what you did here. Wait. I did this. I alone. Geralt tried to stop me. I refused to listen. I might have known. They warned me about you. Sorceresses. None shall open their door to you. None shall feed your hunger, and none shall tend to your wounds. Yen, you didn't have to do that. But I wanted to. I'd rather not talk about it. We must focus on what Skal told us. And learn much, though... Though we can be sure Ciri's not in Skellige anymore. Not in Velen either. Leaves Novigrad, world's biggest city. No one said it would be easy. Better to have some idea where to look than none. <sighs> Makes me wonder what she's gotten herself into. Can't even begin to imagine. But we will pull her out of it. Safe and sound. That I promise you. Key to finding Ciri is that ugly thing Skell saw on the beach. That's what I think. You know, I saw something, or someone who looked just like that. Where? In Velen, in a castle until recently ruled by a self-proclaimed baron, now controlled by his right-hand man, Sergeant Ardle. You must go and get the creature. I don't know, buy him, kidnap him. Seems early to me. What would I do with him, cart him around while I searched for Ciri and hunted monsters? He's safe where he is, with the baron. At least I think so. I'll get him once I know why Ciri went to Novigrad, what she did there. Still a chance I might find her there. All right. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Now, tell me, do you... No, never mind. Ciri's trail in Skellige. We followed it, exhausted the possibilities. Might be time to go back to the continent. Before you do, there's one thing. It's important. What's that? Let's meet in Larvik, at the Warrior's Hall. We'll speak there. I'm Larvik. See you there soon. Thank you. For that, and for your help in the garden. I'd not have managed without you. It was nothing. Geralt, you know me. I'm rare to praise, but when I do, it is sincere.
decided to keep me company? Never know what might come at you deep in a dark forest. You think someone may wish to hurt me? Ugh, witches. I see you're inclined to respond to the call of the wild. Think I should warn off anyone who'd be dumb enough to try. Oof. Always did know how to win, friends. I was provoked. Mm -hmm. Saw it happen. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Faripsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he'd penned in the Emperor's library. Faripsis set off for Skellige one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember. They know what happened to him? The locals say they last saw his ship off the coast of Hindisfjall. Then a once in an eon storm broke. So he's probably fish food by now. Not necessarily. I must learn what became of him. Why? Do you know him? No. It's not the mage who interests me. It's his gym. All right. So what exactly do you expect me to do? You must help me find this gym. I've no gold to offer in reward. But I shall be ever so grateful. Since you put it that way, fine. I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. So you've managed to prepare everything already? I have. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it. That odd boy. Oh, that would make quick work of the beast. Lead the way. Just once, you might try to take the initiative. Would you even let me? It would depend on the situation. The ship carrying the djinn sank somewhere in this area. Not too precise as leads go. I'll cast a spell on our boat. We'll know if there are any wrecks on the seafloor below us. All right, let's get to work. Mind if I take the helm? <sighs> I got a choice. No. I'm not sure this gin thing's a good idea. We managed to seize one before, do you remember? Of course. And lion almost lost his voice that time. <laughs> how lucky your exorcism saved it. It was poetic. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that incantation meant be gone and plow yourself? You should have studied foreign languages. Gonna keep bringing that up for the rest of my life? Of course. Your last wish effectively assured it. My wish was about us being together always, not about you mocking my every mistake. Care for what you wish for. And when your wish is granted, you must accept it with all attendant circumstances. Yeah. And as for your missteps, I don't like you see why I shouldn't laugh if they're amusing. There's something here, on the bottom. It's too deep here. You can't dive that long. You underestimate me. On the contrary. After all, I asked you for help. I'll cast a spell. It will slow your heart for a time. You can stay submerged longer. Asad I cried a rithorn. Ready. Careful down there.
Say we find the gym. What do we do? Ask for a beautiful house, and a palace, and a queen's crown? Are we still talking about the gym, or have we moved on to a talking fish? Doesn't much matter. Both make wishes come true. What would yours be? You learn in deep. Another wreck. Let's see if our gin's down there. A man's skeleton. Somebody pinned his skull to the deck with an axe. A death worthy of a skeleton. Clan emblem indicates a demon man, so he was from Pharaoh. something. A Skelliger's buckler. Clan Hamai symbols. Donar's clan. Donar was a babe in swaddling clothes when this buckler landed here. Yen, doubt any of these boats were the mages. These are old sunken longships. Come back then. We must search elsewhere. Getting better at this. Go even quicker if you helped me down there. I prefer to observe matters from up here, most definitely. Yeah, like when we were looking for the golden dragon and the avalanche swept us off the trail. Me clinging to the remains of a bridge for dear life, you gripping my waist, admiring the view. Remember? The chasm below us was breathtaking. Rustling trees, a lazily flowing stream. I remember. Though I found myself admiring what I had right in front of me. Something strange about those rocks. And there's something on the bottom. We'll see what it is. See something? Something doesn't do it justice. A huge crater, as if a meteorite landed here. I must see it. Diving in after all? No, I shall cast another spell to see through your eyes. Now relax. I see Fultia Badem Ein Achte Ilivade. That is no meteorite crater. What is it then? The effect I see Fultia Badem Ein Achte Ilivade. Silver, Brown Crest Cutlery. Ship belonged to someone awfully wealthy. Amos was no falter. It could very well be his ship.
Only found half. Can you do anything with this? I can use it to locate the other half, to within a dozen yards. And once we find that, we should find the djinn. Exactly. Ready? I'll take us there on the count of three. Oh, no, not another portal. Stop whining. One, two... Three. You said you were gonna go on three. I did. Look, we must search the area. Yen, not so fast. Gotta tell me what this is about first. Why do you want this, Jin? But you already know. A Jin's power is priceless to a mage. Won't warm your way out of it. Not this time. Tell me the truth or I'll leave. You needn't resort to blackmail. You would have learned eventually. True, but after the fact. I want to know now. How long has this been going on, Geralt? This thing between us? Fifteen, twenty years? We repeatedly split up, then return to one another. Something draws us to each other, but I can never be certain if it's a true feeling or merely a bit of mischief by a djinn. So that's it? This is about my last wish? You asked that djinn to bind us together forever. I want to ask this one to take that wish back. Why would you want to do that? To see what it's like without it. To see if we'll still matter to one another. Or if we'll be like two strangers. Hmm. Wondered that myself many times. You see? We're just a step away from learning the truth. Come, let's search the ship. Seems Amos was quite the eccentric, asking the Jinn to lift half his ship to a mountaintop. He didn't necessarily. Jinns are inherently mischievous. This one might have granted his wish and perverted it in doing so. In that case, I'd appreciate it if you didn't wish I'd disappear from your life. I've yet to... Interesting. This means. Mystery of mysteries, Agnes of Glanville. Yen, think you should see this. What do you have? It's Amos. Looks exactly like the etching in the book. Except his head was intact there. If he died while being teleported, Seal might still be on him. Behold. Bravo! Come to the deck. I've an idea. Step back a bit. What are you going to do? Summon and tame the gym. It's not likely to be happy. Stand at the ready. Tem Jim, Riff Kaishta M. Gaia, Kaishta Ep Displayer, Devered Me Castle.
Chu. Your master died before uttering his last wish. I cannot capture you. We can struggle like this for eternity, or I can release you. If you do one thing for me. No. Do you see the spell that binds us? No. Only a jinn can remove another jinn's spell. Remove this one and you'll be free. Storm's over. Yes. It's all over. Maybe we should sit. You look a bit dazed. I'm not, but we can sit. Feel any better? I told you, I'm fine. Don't need to play tough for me. That was a hard fight. Maybe not as hard as the last time we tamed a djinn, but still. <laughs> no comparison, I'm afraid. Half of Rhind suffered then. Now I'm merely a bit tired. Thank you for coming, Geralt. I'd have had a much harder time of it on my own. Oh, I never could say no to you. Hmm. Perhaps that will change now. Feel anything? That anything's... different? Hmm. I expected... I don't know what I expected, actually. A bit of vertigo, perhaps. I thought... you'd become a stranger to me. That I'd look at you and not feel a thing. But it's not like that at all. Nothing's changed. Jen might have cheated us after all. Why? Because I don't feel that anything's changed either. I love you, Yen. And I love you. Oh, what was that? It can't be all sweetness and light. Strange. Done that so many times. But it felt like our first kiss to me. It was in a way. Besides, once you say I love you, a kiss has to taste differently. We ought to test a few other things. Amos's cabin looked cozy. Not so fast, Geralt. We'll have plenty of time to visit cozy cabins later. But I doubt the world will end if we sit here a while. My, it's lovely. Mm -hmm. Think the spirits of Skellige favor us. <laughs> 